Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. You have very warm hands. I was just taking your hands just really? now. Really? It's freezing back there. My hands are freezing. <laughs> You're like a hot water bottle. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> well, um, the Met Gala was Monday night. Yes. My, my lovely wife, Evie, and I were uh, honored to be invited to it. Um, have you recovered yet? Have you gone to sleep yet? Uh, um, barely. It's been a... Um... A lot of recovery time and wondering who's upset about where they where they sat and what went wrong and what went right. But the, the do good... people get upset about where they sit? Oh, uh, unbelievable! In-depth discussions. Yes. No, I understand. You 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 personally like set out where everybody sits, right? Yes. Yes. Okay, so you're you're the person to be mad at specifically. Yes. And if you, how was your seat? I loved my seats, okay. but can I ask you what the rationale was? I'll tell you who I was sitting with. And you tell uh, you me. were sitting next to Sienna Miller. I was, yes. and, and uh, between Sienna Miller and uh, Julie Corden, who yes. is lovely James I thought Gordon's you wife. could talk about late night shows. We, we didn't, but we could have. Yes. And, <laughs> uh, and then uh, Hugh Jackman was over here. Yes. Uh, you... Amal Clooney over yes. here, who never sat down. Uh, Scarlett Johansson. She was a hostess. She was working the table. She was. Uh, Colin Firth. <laughs> yes. Right there. Yes. Um, I have a question about the. Why was I seated with those people? Um, well, obviously, you were a star attraction, and, also, and I thought you were very well dressed. Oh, thank you. And, uh, so you needed me at that end of the table yes, to, to really anchor with some star power, because all exactly. you had was Hugh Jackman yeah. and <laughs> Scarlett. I understand it. I understand yes. it. Thank you for being honest. <laughs> I have a question of the propriety of the evening because it was, there's a dinner. There's not just sort of like the parade of, you know, right. of beauty and costumes right. and fashion. It's a dinner. You sit down. There are courses. Yes. But we're all perfectly well-bred people. We sit down. There's got to be how many people? 24 people at the table or something like that? At uh, the table that you were at, yes, that you a were big the main one. attraction. Yeah. Um, I think it was uh, 26. 26. So you're at the head of the table. You're the host. None of us started eating until you sat down. We well, that, like, was a we, he, that was a mistake because after you sat down, we had to get up again almost immediately. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I was faint we, by yes. the end of the evening. Yeah. I was well, sucking on because breadsticks. Because Pope Rihanna told you that at the sound of the bells, you had to move, right? Yes. Uh, yes. Rihanna, this is ridiculous. I'll show you the photo. Well, let me show you some photos of the evening. So here is, here is Anna right there, just as the high priestess of fashion Thank right you. there, looking lovely. Now, the, the theme, the, would you tell the young people what the theme of the evening was as yes, I show the, these? Yes, uh, the theme of the exhibition is Heavenly Bodies, and it's the influence of the Catholic Church, Catholic imagination on costume. And mm -hmm. Rihanna, as you can all see, you've probably already seen, took, Disco the, Bishop. took the theme <laughs> extremely seriously mm -hmm. and nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> who do you think, who do you think uh, wore it best? Who do you think had the best? I think for the men, it was got to be Chazzy. Chazzy, right? yes, he was in Versace. Chazzy, I actually, yeah. my very favorite was uh, Father James Martin. I don't know if you ran into him. Oh, Jim him. Martin, yeah, he's an old friend yes. of mine. He was well, there. He, he was a Je he's a Jesuit priest who was advising uh, us on the exhibition, and he came in his uh, appropriate robes. And apparently all night, people were coming up to him and saying, I really like the fact that you came as a sexy priest. <laughs> 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 and you look so authentic. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So that was my favorite. That's nice. Yes. <laughs> okay, so sexy priest, that's yes. just it, because fashion is very often sexy. Have you gotten any blowback about using Catholic or people using Catholic iconography or images associated? Uh, not at all, actually. You no know, one's been upset? Not at all. We, we were, worked very closely with the Vatican through the whole process. And Cardinal Dolan, as I believe you know, was uh, one of our guests of honor at he the dinner. He was there. He looked and he was there fabulous. And, and Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Although he disappointed me, he promised me he was going to wear his red cape, and he left that at home. But yeah, Cardinals have that big scarlet cape. Yes, yeah. yes. And he didn't think he got enough to eat either, yeah. apparently. But, um, <laughs> Well, there were some other be really beautiful outfits that night that I, I just really enjoyed. Did you like what Madonna was wearing? I did, she I did. Sort of a... She was uh, in Jean-Paul Gaultier, looking yes. traditionally Madonna. She had a veil. Yes, and she was actually yep. the reason that you didn't get to eat, because we were running from the dinner into the Great Hall to have our surprise performance, which was Madonna. Right, with the bell tolled. Ask yes, not for whom the yes, bell tolls. Yes. It tolls for many monks, watch Madonna. Many monks, and then one of the monks... Real monks. Real, well, real I'm not monks. sure they were quite no, as they were real, real monks. as... they were real monks. <laughs> Maybe not quite as real mm -hmm. as Father Martin, but... No. Um, oh, here's Amal Clooney right there. Yes. 
Yes. Mal Clooney, right well, there. Well, Amal actually arrived on the red carpet in this amazing dress. Uh, yeah. Richard Quinn, that's not it. That's Tom okay. Ford, Stephen. Yep. Um, but she wore this incredible... You're going to yell at me for the entire Yes, I interview? am. You've got to get... <laughs> But she wore this incredible dress on the red carpet that was designed by a young British designer called Richard Quinn, but it was made of tin foil. So she was a little bit concerned it might rip during the evening. So she went into the gift shop and she changed into this extraordinary Tom Ford dress, which is designed to look like a uh, stained glass. And also- You was sell this at the gift shop? <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was just astronaut ice cream and like paperweights oh, oh, and- uh... Only if you're a Mal Clooney. Okay, all right, all right. Now, there were a couple of outfits that were like political statements. Okay. Lena Waithe, yes. You had uh, yes. Lena Waithe. Yes. Who wore yes. Uh, Carolina Slightly. Herrera. LGBTQ. And a, uh, LGBTQ empowerment flag. And also, this was, to me, uh, there, there were two dresses that stood out. My own wife, there, Evely, looking beautiful in Christian Siriano. Yes. And Scarlett Johansson, Scarlett Johansson here wearing, is it Marquesa or Marchesa? That's Marquesa. Marquesa. Absolutely beautiful. Not so much with the theme, so much of the Catholic imagination, but she wore it, she said, as, as a, a statement that Harvey Weinstein's wife, who is partner in this, com in this mm -hmm. company, shouldn't be punished for the sins of and her And I husband. totally agree with that. I mean, Georgina is a brilliant designer, and I don't think that she should be uh, blamed for her husband's behavior. And I think it was a great gesture of support on S Scarlett's part to wear a dress like that, a beautiful dress like that, on such a public occasion. Well, it was a lovely evening. Thank you again for inviting me and Evie. Thank you for coming. Um, we uh, don't go away because uh, we shot a little piece backstage at the Restoration Lab at yes. the Costume Institute of the Met, and we want to show that to you when we come back. We'll be right back Wait. with more Anna Winter, everybody.